which means which means amnesia and tetro who probably have the lowest ping relative to each other will be fighting in losers finals this also means amnesia has no excuses here <laughs> no excuses this this is probably his ideal opponent from a network latency perspective <sighs> So, because this is Losers Finals, we are switching up to first to three. But Amnesia and Tetro, whenever you're ready. We'll see if Amnesia left for another smoke or not. I mean, could be. He didn't say anything about it this time. I'd, I'd love to see a Tetro Grand Finals. I've, I don't think I've ever seen him make it as far as Grand Finals. Between his early bedtimes and everything else, he's a very strong yeah. player, but he's never actually pushed it that far in bracket. Like, it's usually been that in, like, extenuating circumstances, so, you know, we'll see what happens. Okay, players are in match. I, I would have found it funny if he said challenge. You know what we have not seen this tournament? No items or cement? No item mode. No item mode usually makes some sort of appearance. I mean, I think you laid down precedent pretty early that what people want to play through here. Especially that, like, everyone here, except maybe some of the lowest seeds, are pretty well versed enough to act through most any of it. But, like, uh, anyone who knows versus versus people who are less familiar with it, I wonder if the tactical garbage of no item would have been a solid pick. I mean, could be. So Amnesia with a very, very nice down stack opportunity here. Love to see that Zed get sniped. If Amnesia was slightly faster, it would have been the eyepiece instead. I swear he hesitated because he knew his piece was about to get sniped. So if I have the right read on that, absolute god tier play. Okay, and Emney's a little hung up here. Tetra's not playing fast enough to really capitalize on. It. We got a death block there. Sends a triple. Uh, Amnesia it's... really wants his J piece to be death block, and Tetro denies it. Big L. But that... Big L detected. <laughs> I. I, I'm curious. I, the, the J piece didn't even see that good. I don't know why Amnesia was so dead set on uh, getting it. I don't know. Okay, spending Delhi, and they're both going pretty even tempo here. Um, Tetra is starting to pull ahead a little bit. What? Okay. Uh oh. Amnesia is throwing the leg switch. Oh no. So that he can Johns after the match. Oh no. Oh, Amnesia going greedy. I mean, fair. Just. He I, has the answer for all of it. I don't know. See, the the problem with sending Tetris holes of garbage is that they can bounce right they, back. They I will come back. Yeah. So all it takes is a, a choice item or something, and he's going to regret having ever sent that to Tetro. Oh, lasers I mean, laser coming out. It hits center board. board. Oh, my God. That is... Okay. Amnesia does the correct play with the Dell upper there. Manages to cash it in. That was very nearly a disaster. That's a very, very subtle thing, but so many players would dump that item in the laser hole where it would be guaranteed to not clear. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, Tetris. Oh, wow! What happened there? I mean, he still won, but wow! Uh, that, that's what the, happened there? The Tetris hole bouncing back? I think that's what we saw. So, uh, ironically, if, if he had cashed in that triple and not send any garbage, because item cashins do not send garbage, uh, then there would not have been a giant bulge of counterattack waiting 
in, in Tetris deck. Yes, I did just say giant bulge uh, live on stream during a Tetris tournament. That sounds like a you problem. Rats, did you accidentally ban the wrong person? Did you... Poor Legrand? Can we unban oh. Legrand? One of them was a bot. Oh god. Poor Legrand. No, the other way around. Oh, oh they, they were, were both okay. bots? Okay, okay. Oh, Tetra Dell up or Amnesia kinda kinda not having a lot of room. Okay. Down sack is finally in progress. Amnesia needs some way. very specific pieces though. Okay, he appears to be getting them. Tetro is not letting up the pressure, and this 180 could be lethal. Oh, Amnesia messes up the placement. What is this? Amnesia, my dude. You know, this, this, is a, this is a pretty spicy loser's finals. Mm-hmm. We may have an upset, which would be hype. Oh, hard block that point on the O. Just accepts it. Uh, and it gets Dell lower, so that. That was a very good Dell lower, though. It got rid of so much material. He's going to need this space to actually digest this hard block. He's uh, definitely running out of room to not set it off anymore. Yeah, that's, that's a little awkward. It's a little awkward, but you know, he, worst, he has but... the space for it. That's that's the the important thing is he does have a down stack waiting for him. Didn't get to convert that damage because of the color block, but but Tetro is just like playing single player Tetris right now. Amnesia is not putting on any pressure at all. Yeah, a whole ten level lead with players like these is uh, actually pretty significant. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Okay. Try, tried to mash for the eye block. Yeah. Did not. Oh my god. At high G, that's very risky. That's so, probably the worst transform we've seen today. Yeah, and I think if he just played the pieces without trying to mash, I think he had this in the bag. So. Uh, he I mean, have, he's still fighting. He's still fighting, but he very well may have thrown. See, look, look at this. Amnesia. Gets the Dell frickin' upper. Amnesia is laughing oh, here. He wow. had the right piece. He failed the uh, basic rotation there. Okay, good mix-ups coming from Tetro. Amnesia is uh, forced to respond. So Tetro is setting setting the pace of the game here. Hmm. But Amnesia does uh, three singles later. You know, he does chew through the mix-up. He gets a T-double on his way down. Okay. That's a, all things told, a pretty good situation for Amnesia right now. If... If the knife piece comes, oh, and unfortunately it is the Dell Upper. Amnesia caches it in, sees this laser coming. The laser hits the far side. Oh, he critical misdrop again. It's hard to not misdrop under pressure. Man, so I guess. Excellent comeback from Amnesia. They're tying the series up 1-1. This is loser's finals. It is first to three. Still lots of room for both players to show us what they've got. A 180 burying a Dell upper. Oh, Amnesia not playing into the next piece. He could have had the L double there. He just completely missed it. And that, that would have... 
that would have wrecked Tetro's garbage stack just enough to not let Tetro have the pressure that, that ended up closing out the round. I don't know. Tetro's looking pretty solid. So, like, as long as we don't get a critical misdrop here or there, it feels like he has, has better tempo and pressure than Amnesia right now. So I think Amnesia might be too prideful to take my advice, but my number one advice, both to combat rollbacks and lag, as well as to strategically make the right choice. Um, in a lot of situations, you do not want to play this game at your full speed. You want to make oh, like, use um... of the next preview, and you want to maximize how awkward things are for your opponent, even if it slows you down a bit. Frankly, I was getting like some mileage in my sets just by playing soft exclusively. Not advisable at like, this level, but... Del Upper mm -hmm. is huge for Amnesia there. He was out of the game until it showed up. Now this mirror is very annoying. But he gets through it. Continues to downstack. Amnesia's got an immense amount of pressure here. Now it's going to be Tetro on the ropes. X-Ray's not going to do a whole lot. Okay, Snipe coming up from Tetro. Is actually reasonable. Definitely doing more damage than the, the color effect. <laughs> okay, Amnesia's got a nice center board. He does get the T. It's always tragic if you set that up and then get droughted. Oh, wow. Actually matched for the eye and got it. Oh, and Tetro's got the Dell upper now. Doesn't even need it. Closes out the point. Advantage Tetro. Okay. Tetro is being counterpicked to death mode. Interesting. I wonder if Amnesia was listening to my stream or if he uh, he was maybe just thinking of this strategy himself. You see, you. Tetro is strong, but you'll you know he doesn't have quite the same confidence in playstyle that that he has in uh, pure master mode. I mean, I think we talked about this, especially with the Caithness was still playing. This. You don't necessarily need to play death fast if you play death smart in versus. Honestly, I'm quite impressed with how Tetra's playing. I think he's he's been practicing death mode. Well, you know, is that's it, good for bracket next month. Well, reminder mm. to everyone, next month, our tournament will be on March 25th, which is the start of the Carnival of Death. We will have a special death-only tournament. So hopefully you'll find that interesting, either to participate or tune in. Okay, and he's just really starting to mount some pressure here. Uh, hard block's gonna potentially. Ooh, no! 180 is gonna destroy Way. that. But if he gets an IPC, he gets it. Oh, this is tight. Oh, okay, good. Amnesia barely closes it out there. <laughs> Yeah, X, X Keeper, they're they're open open brackets. Um, they are they do start a little early in the morning because we we want to be inclusive to our European friends. Oh, but they're absolutely a good time. So the counter pick worked. Amnesia ties it up two two. This is going to game five. Amnesia has a lot of garbage to deal with. And the Dell Upper gets sniped. That is huge. Amnesia's board right now is very delicate. He has so many downstacks to do. 
Those are kind of like piece dependencies because you need specific pieces to su successfully downstack. Mm -hmm. So Amnesia gets through it. Now Tetro has to deal with the reciprocal attack. Oh, beautiful fast roll roll movement followed by an incredible roll roll fail on Amnesia's side. Very interesting juxtaposition there. Uh, user, uh, there are some Japanese players on Fightcade, uh, but not any that I recognize. Oh, no. Wow, Amnesia threatening set point here. So I'm, I'm not following the betting pool here, but I'm curious. Who put their money on Tetro? There's no bet. Ah, you guys are no fun. Okay, transform. Uh, follow up with a little bit of pressure there. Yo, Rats, if you're interested, DM me. I've got it fully automated. I just have to run a Python script in the background while I stream. Wait, that's an automated process? To get the poll, the the gambling polls, yeah. Well, no, we've been doing it manually at Puzzle Wednesday for a while now. Yeah, there's there's more charm in ours. It's true. That. It's true. Uh, I, again, crucial misplacement here. This could it's dull even. Very it's... well be it. Tetro is color oh, that block, color is, block not is not what you want. What you want. He desperately needs to find. Bigger damage. Oh, he gets the L piece. One piece too late. I'm so but upset. Amnesia's having trouble closing out this round, though. Is he BMing with the slow placements? Yo, that is not cool. No! <sighs> Amnesia Jeez. takes it. I, I, I think it's disrespectful to slow down when you think you've won a set like that. But that's just me. Anyway, no, that was still a really good showing. But with that, it's Grand's time. Yes, Grand Finals. Uh, so let's see if I remember how to play. It's been a solid hour.